Hello everyone, you are watching the channel Incredible Facts. The Cottonmouth is a purpose-built prototype advanced reconnaissance vehicle developed by a partnership between Textron Systems and Elbit Systems of America for the U.S. Marine Corps. The vehicle was built in response to the USMC's Advanced Reconnaissance Vehicle Program. The validation testing of Cottonmouth commenced at the National Automotive Test Center in February 2021. The USMC will assess the capabilities of the prototypes delivered under the Advanced Reconnaissance Vehicle Competition and select a winning model in 2023. Before we get started, if you do enjoy this video and would like to see more just like it, remember to give us a like and subscribe to our channel to get more sent straight to your notifications. The Cottonmouth 6x6 Reconnaissance Vehicle has a length of 270 inches 6 .8 meters, width of 114.5 inches 2.9 meters, and a height of 121.9 inches, 3.09 meters. The gross weight of the vehicle is 37,000 pounds, 16,783 kilograms. The ARV can attain a maximum speed of 65 miles per hour, 104 kilometers per hour, and withstand wave heights of 4 feet, 1.21 meters. The vehicle is operated by a crew of two and can carry up to five Marines. The Cottonmouth was designed to accommodate a turret. Though the prototype was fitted with a remotely controlled weapon station armed with a 12.7 mm heavy machine gun and Javelin anti-tank guided missile launcher, the missiles can strike hostile tanks and armored vehicles beyond the line of sight. This armored vehicle is fitted with advanced reconnaissance and surveillance sensors. It will also have unmanned aircraft systems with automatic launch and retrieval capability. The main role of the Cottonmouth is to observe the surroundings, find targets. It can even engage some of the targets, though offensive capabilities of this armored vehicle is rather humble. Even though the Cottonmouth is a new armored vehicle that benefits from the latest technologies, it loses to the legacy LAV-25 in some areas, including firepower and internal volume. This is because a concept of the USMC reconnaissance vehicle has changed. The LAV-25 is a heavily armored troop carrier that combines its speed, mobility, and firepower to fulfill various missions. It is used as a fighting vehicle for reconnaissance, raiding, and screening operations. Dismounts are supported by the 25mm cannon. On the other hand, the Cottonmouth will use a different approach and exploits its advanced long-range sensors rather than armor, firepower, and mobility. This new armored vehicle is fully amphibious. On water, it is propelled by two water jets. It can be launched from amphibious assault ships and operate in the open sea. The Cottonmouth is rather versatile and can be configured to fulfill various roles. It can be used as an armored personnel carrier and for various other roles. The vehicle features a compact design and was built based on an open architecture platform to enable the integration of advanced systems in the future. Four Cottonmouth ARVs can be transported using a single ship-to-shore connector, which is a landing craft air cushion LCAC, vehicle. The ARV is equipped with multi-spectrum sensors and stealth capabilities. The sensors enable seamless communication between the Navy and Marine Corps during joint missions, allowing them to deploy unmanned systems as well as weapon systems. The vehicle is designed to provide enhanced maneuverability. The Cottonmouth is a next-generation amphibious vehicle designed to serve as the naval sensor node of the USMC. The synergized sensor system of the vehicle will support reconnaissance operations. It can be deployed in support of expeditionary advanced base operations. It will provide enhanced land and amphibious mobility. The versatile platform can be used as a force multiplier and to support electronic warfare missions. The automatic target recognition capability allows operators to see enemy platforms before the ARV is detected. As part of the partnership, Elbit Systems of America will provide the Situational Awareness Vision Suit for the Cottonmouth prototype. The ARV will be equipped with Elbit Systems of America's Iron Vision, a see-through head-mounted display technology that provides crew members with enhanced visibility and 360-degree situational awareness. The Iron Vision system will combine preloaded terrain and obstacle information, as well as smart battlefield symbology, to provide a single, unified picture of the surroundings simultaneously to all crew members. The enhanced situational awareness will increase the lethality and safety of the platform and crew members. 
The comprehensive picture will be displayed on the Iron Vision helmet-mounted display and crew workstations, enabling the crew to see through the vehicle's armor. The USMC plans to replace its aging fleet of light-armored vehicles, which have been in service since the 1980s and whose life cycle is expected to expire in the mid-2030s. The new Advanced Reconnaissance Vehicle will replace the USMC's existing LAV fleet. The procurement requirement is for a highly mobile, networked, transportable, and lethal armor vehicle. It will be able to sense, shoot, move, and communicate. The USMC also requires the ARV to operate as part of a teaming arrangement with manned, unmanned systems and serve as the manned hub for such a team. The ARV is expected to provide multi-domain, mobile reconnaissance capabilities. The Office of Naval Research announced in September 2019 that it would sponsor research for the development of a next-generation ARV for the USMC. The effort to develop the vehicle is part of the Department of Navy's Future Naval Capabilities Program, whose aim is to identify, evaluate, and accelerate new technologies to make them ready for acquisition. The Office of Naval Research outlined that the future ARV will be equipped with transformational sensors, communications, and combat capabilities. It also highlighted the need for the ARV to be able to detect and identify threats from longer distances. What do you think of the Cottonmouth? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give us a like and subscribe to our channel to get our latest videos straight to your notifications.